Good morning, my dear friends. Welcome back to another video review. We have today two diamond paintings from a diamond painting company. Now they are kind of coordinating, I would say today, fantasy unboxing maybe uh, because of the nature of this canvases. So let's start with the smallest one. I was actually very excited. I waited this canvases to see because I thought they were really beautiful and I hope you have the same taste as I do. I think many of you will like this one. Look at this. Okay, I just quickly readjust my screen. Okay, so I'm seeing in the right direction. We have diamonds in here already pre-packed into the Ziploc bags. So I will show you just this way. It's a lot of gray and blues. Some splash of purple. Kind of hard to see. And well, basically it's mostly in here. Um, blues and gray. Kind of like a mossy color. Yeah. Few shades of purple. But look at this. Isn't she gorgeous? Look how beautiful this angel. Let me get rid of a few of the wrinkles in here so you can see a little bit better. Maybe even to open like this. It's going to be very, very static. Very, very static. Yeah. Oh, even lifted. Look at this. It's lifting my, my table. Hold on. It's lifting so static. There, look at the beautiful wing, and I think it's a dove sitting on her hand. There's some flowers underneath, um, and the, her face is really pretty in here. Size of this canvas is 40 by 60 centimeters. Oh, it's actually um, straightened up so nicely. I do have a one air bubble. Let's give it up this side. I like to keep my canvases right now flat. I don't put them back into the bags. So they all stay in flat on my table. I have many different folders and boxes for diamonds. I keep them separate. Usually I put uh, a label for example, uh, after this video unboxing, I would put name in here, a diamond painting. So I know where I got this from. I would put same thing, label a diamond painting in here with the writing on of this number in here of diamond painting. And also I would put probably angel. So that way I kind of, if I go through so many canvases, same size, I would know that I need to look for the angel with the diamonds, okay? So that's how I do it. Now this is a square, square diamonds. You already probably catch that. That's pretty. So uh, how many colors? 24 colors we have in here canvas is really nice and first of all it's very glittery lots of sparks in here uh, glue if I can show you a like, very very close canvas you can see that you see how it's um, a layer of the glue have have thick layers like especially like when you can see like right in here and there's lots of uh, glitter spikes up there too. Canvas clarity, really nice. Very nice. And to show you a little bit face of her, maybe this way. When you look on a website, she looks absolutely stunning. Very pretty. Oh, let's, let's see if on this little tiny thumbnail, if we're going to see a little bit better picture or not. It's gorgeous. I have to say it's gorgeous. There. As close as I can get. 
So this is one angel. Another one diamond painted and not exactly angel, but it's also beautiful. Now of diamonds, um, I should count them probably first, but usually if they already pre-packed into the Ziploc bags, usually there's no missing diamonds. I think they all should be here. I just going to, the only thing I will look, by the way, yes, I forgot to mention to you, it is a uh, toolkit included, of course. Does anybody in here watching my video today that never done diamond painting yet? Because it's been from many, many years now. I just want to see like, like this in a bag through if I see some nice colors. For example, I found the most pretty one. The rest of gray and blue. But this tree, for example, if I can just show you the most kind of like a brightest one and they look good those square diamonds i have to say look really nice to me how about black do we have a three ten in here let's see let's see legend on both sides in here uh huh we don't have a three ten in here okay good because I do not like 310 anyway. They usually not as good quality diamonds as the other ones. So I'm glad we have no 310 in here. Hooray! I like that. Okay, now this one is gorgeous. And I think the other one you will love as well. Let me show you. This one will have much bigger size of the canvas. find let's find how to open this canvas remind me that maybe I saw already cross stitch similarity to this one I'm not sure but look I think I feel like I saw like this only one lady and the other lady in here and a different design for some reason i feel like i saw cross stitch of separate of them in here they kind of add them together so i don't know if they belong kind of like this together or not but definitely i like the way um, a diamond painting uh, store do their canvases uh, pre-pack and all into the Ziploc bags and I think even previously when we did some video review I think they also were already in the bags I love this com concept because then you are ready to diamond paint and you don't have to count all those little bags that some company went to those tiny bags of um, diamonds organizing I don't know why but it is um, here it is, uh, same kit with one placer and one, one bolt, is this the one, yes, and one pen, two wax. Uh, this canvas is with round diamonds, one is square, one with round, we will check them a little bit later. Uh, let's see, 24 colors in here also, and this one is 80 by 50 centimeters so what do you think which one of these two canvases you like more or you like them together oh she remind me like a cinderella dress look how beautiful um when i'm looking right now on the actual on the camera i can see that she looks so much better on camera than from my point of view. I love all those ruffles and wrinkles on her dress. Um, yeah, definitely. If this dress would be blue or just like a pure white, that would make a Cinderella. Which is funny, when I was a kid we had a Cinderella movie which she was wearing a white dress in here. We have Cinderella who's wearing a blue dress, so I don't know 
who is she? Could be Beauty and the Beast. She's she's uh, wearing a um, gold dress. But anyway, I I love this. So this is like a day and night. You could you could think because of the brightness of this image and dark one of this one. Let's just check the other lady in here. Let me just get this a little bit. Hopefully not to flip. For some reason, everything is really, really static. I like how um, a diamond painting store uh, shipping my canvases. They always um, uh, ship them in those heavy-duty bubble um, bubble bag on the inside those bubbles and they put um, like for example put diamond paintings into the bag and then fold them it's like three time to roll them because the bag is big so that's why um, i like the conditions of diamond paintings always uh really nice not damaged so that bubble wrap bag definitely helps a lot Okay, she has, uh, oh, she's, it's like a butterfly vein or something in here. Yeah, oh, maybe she's a, okay, are they, are, because I see the peacock in here now when I turn canvas towards me. Maybe it's a white and dark peacock, ladies. I don't know, but it's something definitely uh, fantasy about them. They are not just the regular girls. They are definitely some magical creatures, I think. Let me look better. Okay, just a little bit more in here. I want to see, I want to see this little tiny picture in here. Yeah, so the dark hair lady, she's staying. So that's not actually when what I was looking about. That's actually background showing that she has a long dark hair. I see peacock and they're looking somewhere, somewhere up there. They see in something, something far away. If you look this way, but definitely their view pointing to that direction. First, I saw, like towards me, because my point view are so close, I thought this is like a wing in here behind her, but that's a background. It's just an illusion because she has a nice, beautiful long hair. There's a beautiful bird, and I think the tail is kind of like a half open, maybe. Uh, sky, very magical. Very, very good clarity canvas will be easy to work on what do you think i like how she in here is like a sun go to it's like a sunrise maybe and the light is flashing on her and all this dress is glowing and gold i really like it so i thought well let me do a fantasy unboxing this time so i picked two of this diamond paintings okay so now diamonds in here also packed all into the ziplock bags and they are oh, kind of you can see them all in here the colors maybe some is hiding but majority of the colors we can see this way some pinkish up there Maybe from this side you can see some pickable. Um, I don't think I'm, I, I have to count them. I will count diamonds uh, bags under video because I want to make sure um, the bags is sealed or maybe I just going to label it and not even touch it. I see already here like a little label in here. ADP for... Yeah, that's already actually... Uh, number same as um, the canvas itself in, in here on the top in here but I like a little bit bigger sticker and I could put in here uh, 
peacock ladies because the peacock in here so i need to some kind of uh find the name or fantasy ladies i don't know something to when i find the diamonds i will see better which canvas i'm looking for so what do you think between these two what do you think which one you like better this one of course is just very very soft image wool and blue um and look at that of course much much smaller so 60 by 40 and 80 by 50 it's a nice size of the canvas both of them looks beautiful so if you have some comments which one you like better please comment one is a square diamonds one is a round diamonds and all the link will be uh, of course under my video in the description box if you have any questions ask i will try to answer if i know the answer to your question and check out the link of course check the store they always have something new up there and you never know maybe you'll find something even more gorgeous that fit your um, desire i should say well thank you very much to the company for shipping this product uh, so nicely there's no damage whatsoever uh, nicely done and thank you all for watching and i will see you tomorrow <laughs>